Boxing King Media in association with boxer Gavin Gwynn and still the British champion. Uh, are you happy with that result? Not really. I thought I just pinched it by a couple of rounds. Um, some of the rounds were tight, uh, me being the champion and I thought I was working, the, I had the higher work rate, I thought they were just, would just have given them to me, like the one score cards, 116, 113, I, was just, I thought that was just right, um, but you can see the other score cards, why they give it a draw, they, some, t some rounds are tight, do you know what I mean, it, but it is what it is, I still got my belt, um, yeah. You won a lot of the earlier rounds but at some point you kind of allowed him back into the fight, oh, yeah. why was that? Um, I thought I was getting, do you know what, I was getting quite easy in the middle of rounds and uh, Tony gave me a telling off end, I think it was round eight, nine. He said, what are you doing? He said, wake up, you're going off the boil. Like, so I started letting my hands go again. And then um, I thought the one that remained of the last like three rounds. But it is what it is. You're still the champion. Obviously, great put up, a really good fight. Yeah. Um, what, what do you want to do next? Defend that again? You want that outright? Um, I just say no. I'm, I'm 32 now, so I want to push on for bigger, bigger titles. Um, if the European title is there, or I'd, I'd fight the winner, Max Hughes, Kid Gala, I'd like next, yeah. I just want these big fights. I'm, I'm always in good fights, and uh, with Wasserman's backing now, hopefully they can push for that, and uh, yeah. Definitely. You mentioned Tony there. Tony Lee ended up in a scrap himself at the end. <laughs> what, what was all that about? Oh, some numpty, <laughs> some numpty jumped in the ring. Uh, haven't even got a license. Uh, throwing his weight about, he probably can't even scrap. Below. Oh, yeah. You had Lee Eaton in your corner, I'm sure Lee can look after himself. What, what, do, you, what do you think of his performance, Lee? Um, listen, I, I thought, listen, Gavin can win, uh, obviously can box a lot better. Um, obviously, he's, he ain't going to I don't know if he said, but listen, he's got a bad hand two weeks ago. Uh, obviously, it pulled, but listen, there's no excuses. I thought he won the fight um, by a minimum two rounds. Um, Craig Woodruff just had the f uh, at performance of his life. A so fair play to Craig. Do you know what I mean? You can't, you can't n knock the boy. He's, he's a lovely kid, um, but his team at the end barging me and then screaming and shouting at uh, Tony Borg. Listen, don't act like that in the ring. It's a gentleman's sport. Um, a pair of fucking idiots in, in my eyes. Um, and listen, we, we ain't, they ain't getting the rematch for the way they're acted. They can go fuck themselves. Gavin said he wants the winner of Barry Al or Maxi Hughes. Yeah, 100%. Listen, obviously we need to get his hand sorted, but listen, why not? Maxi Hughes and Barry are great fighters. Um, Gavin's, Gavin's ready to go. Give him a few months and then we can get if we can get the winner of that, that'd be lovely. Obviously, he's with Wasserman now. Um, I think it's Allen Brothers. I'm sure they'll be able to get big fights for him, so we're looking forward to it. They were happy with my performance as well. <laughs> so, yeah, he said... Um, yeah, we're happy to sign you. Um, great performance. Um, crowd please, pleasing performance. And uh, obviously, live, how many viewers was it tonight? Over? I was probably going to get a million. Oh, no, no club, not far off a million viewers. So um, it's just going to raise my profile as well. Um, big thank you goes to Lee Eaton for getting that signed up to me. Yeah. Definitely, mate. It was an entertaining fight. And uh, I'm sure the fans, you won yourself loads of new fans. Well done, mate. And uh, good luck with whatever comes next for you. Thank you very much. Thank you. I'm just going to grab Tony yeah. whilst we're in. Tony, are you able to tell us what, what, what went on just as the final bell went? Yeah, one or two um, idiots jumped in the ring. They're not, li not licensed. They're just uh, fantasy coaches. They're not, they, you know, not, they're not doing nothing. And they uh, come in and in jumped in the ring, chatting up loads of nonsense. Um, making silly little threats and then wanted to sh shy away. Just don't need it, do we? They got something to say, comes. They got something I need to get hold of. You got, you got a problem coming to me? I won't mess with you, Tony. But did you guys make up at the end? Sorry? Did you make up at the end? No, I don't do making up. Right. Never. Right. Someone pisses me off, it's for life. And that's the right time. Well, I'm not going to piss you off in that case, Tony. <laughs> well done, congratulations anyway. I know where it's